Hello Capricorn, this is you versus them for the 5th through the 11th. Welcome to the channel you guys. If you're new, please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. Let's see what you were dealing with before Cappy's Nine of Pentacles. Trying to stand on your own two feet, I feel. Um, getting used to being single um, by yourself, getting your confidence back if somebody, you know, helped you to tear it down, okay? Um, but, you know, you're getting your stride back here, I feel. Let's see what's going on with the other person. Eight of Wands, maybe they're traveling. Um, maybe they are trying to or have been trying to communicate with you, get back in touch with you, um, sending you loving messages even. Maybe they are trying to date you, this person. Sagittarius energy here. Hmm. Let's see what's keeping you from this person, if anything. The Ten of Wands, feeling like, you know, you were doing all the work, okay? Now you feel like you just want to work on yourself, okay? I'm just working on myself. I don't have any time for anybody else that, you know, is not going to put in the work that I put in. Just kind of take in what it is that you have right now and moving forward. Just saying, you know what, I'm done with that. It is what it is here. Okay, let's see what's keeping them from you. Oh, gosh. The fact that they are just so in their feelings right now. Um, maybe they are... I don't know. Maybe this person is used to you like handling everything, making everything better. Um, but right now they're feeling like, you know, there's nothing they can do in this situation. You've told them that you're done with this. Um, you're tired of carrying all the weight and they are feeling very regretful, very hurt, sorrowful here. Um, not really focusing on the love that you guys still have. But the fact that, you know, y'all are not coming together right now is the thing. So I think this is them not working on themselves, to be honest with you. Um, they, they want to be with you for sure and feel very attracted to you. But they, they're so focused on what it is that they have lost here and not focusing on what it is that you guys still have. There's still love here. Okay. The fact of the matter is that you're just not really willing to do everything by yourself anymore is what it is okay let's see what's currently going on with you guys the moon see things clearly um i think you you really do have deep feelings for this person for sure because i see that here with the two of cups but i feel like there's a lot that that you have realized that you know you can't carry a relationship by yourself then otherwise you just are in a relationship by yourself and I think that you have kind of put your foot down right here okay you put your foot down you you're just seeing things clearly right now that you cannot do this by yourself it takes two let's see what's currently going on with them ace of cups hmm wanting to offer you some love wanting to tell you how much they love you I feel like they've been sending messages and you have like kind of been not really shooting it down but I think you want to hear a little more than I love you you want to see more you want to see actual work being put into this connection okay because um, you know actions speak louder than words I know that's cliche but it's, it's the dang on truth Let's see what the outside influence is for you guys here. The Queen of Wands, yeah. You just want to move on. You want to move on to things that that vibe with you, okay? There's something that you're excited about doing. You want to move forward. You want forward moving movement. And I felt like there was something that was kind of holding you back in this connection. You felt like, um, I don't think you felt your best self here. But now it's like you're wanting to you're wanting to do more things. You're wanting to travel, possibly start up your own business. Um, it's like you run around doing everything for everyone else. But now I think you're you're focusing on yourself and what actually makes you happy. Is what is is what's happening here, and I feel like this relationship with this person you feel like has has brought you down. 
somewhat. Let's see what their outside influence is here. Oh, okay. So we have this one as well. Huh, and the star. There's some major changes going on with um, the person that that you are thinking about here. Hmm. Major changes. And um, I think that this person, you know, right now they're they're like overly emotional. They're all in their feelings. But um, it's like, you know, exterior to them, there there's these two major arcana with the justice and the star is saying that you know do there's a need for them to to do what they feel is right but use use some logic with it use some logic with it um, because right now they're they're overly emotional they're probably not thinking a whole lot just kind of feeling and reacting feeling and reacting and and it's not coming across um, the right way with you so there's a need for them to change up some things in their life, okay? The way that they, the way that they um, interact, the way that they make decisions here, they need to come from a more logical uh, perspective. I feel, and I think that energy is like pushing them to do that. And I feel like they're going through that change. This person's healing, and I feel like they are definitely going through a change where they will try to. Um, come from a more logical point of view, which I think is what you probably need. They need not be so emotional and come from such an emotional standpoint because it comes across to you, I feel like, as unstable and needy. So I think they're going through their own healing right now, okay? Let's see what the blockage is for you guys. The Four of Cups. <laughs> Um, right now, you're just not really accepting um, anything that they have to say, I feel. Any any love that they're trying to offer, it's like you are you're like, nope, 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 can't do it right now. Nope. Mm -mm. It's too much for me. So you're kind of blocking it. Okay. I think their, their emotional health um, is at question for you. And I think for you, they need to calm down a little bit. Okay because it's kind of overwhelming and so now you're just like with your arms crossed not accepting anything from them okay let's see what their blockage is here the two of swords mm -hmm. and two minds not seeing things clearly but I feel like here with the star and justice they will start they will start to see things clearly Right now, they're just so in their feelings. They're really not. They're not thinking logically. Okay. This is this is swords thinking. Justice makes a decision from you know a logical perspective. The star is is watery, but it's also the card of Aquarius. You know, bridging the gap, bringing people back together, healing energy here. Okay. So I think this is all about this person, you know, not really, you know, just overwhelming you with emotions and I love yous and, uh, but I want you and that sort of thing. I think it's like mm, you can do without that right now. <laughs> you need, you need some some reason, some reasoning going on here. Let's see what the advice is for Capricorn. Seven of Wands. Hmm. I think this is for you to not be so closed off, but at the same time, stand your ground, you know, stand your ground, but stand your ground um, reasonably, okay? Do not let your guard down as far as this person um, and if they are emotionally unstable, you feel. No, stand your ground with that, but if they are coming to you logically, um, within reason I think there's a need for you to actually hear this person out okay let's see what their advice is here the ten of pentacles I think they need to work definitely on themselves and they need to get they need to find the fulfillment like within themselves first is what I'm getting here 
okay spend time with themselves not try to you know make you spend time with them or feel like the only way they can be happy is if you guys are together I think they need to find their stability um, within themselves like really get to know themselves here is what I'm getting with that okay let's see what's coming in for you guys here what's coming in for Capricorn the page of wands some of you, I feel like, may be interested in someone else, something else here. Maybe a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But there's definitely an interest being piqued here. I think exterior to this energy. It's coming in for them as a knight of swords. Uh, them, you know, this is logic. This is definitely logic here with the Knight of Swords speaking the truth. So I feel like this person definitely will get to a point where they can actually, you know, come across as somebody that's stable, somebody that's grounded. Um, but they're still very anxious here. This night moves very fast. Um, so they get an idea in their head and then they go for it, you know, that sort of thing. So I, I really feel like this person um, is coming in with some truth about loving you or this is somebody else that is coming into their energy to offer them something here could be you guys okay because there again you know you are interested in something here that's coming in for you maybe this is a fire sign maybe they're just like very watery right here you know very emotional even okay but there's somebody coming in to speak some truth to them Or either they're coming in to speak some truth to you about, you know, starting over. But I think they're coming from a very logical standpoint when they do come in, if they come in. Because there again, the Knight of Swords speaks the truth, okay? Let's see what's, um, what's the outcome for you guys here. What is the outcome for Capricorn? The Hierophant. This is also you, you know standing your ground you know knowing what knowing what you want and um, holding yourself and others to that standard for some of you this is marriage okay definitely for some of you maybe this is a question of marriage here with justice and the Hierophant and the Ten of Pentacles let's see what the outcome is for them the Four of Cups. Mm. Hmm. I feel like this person will be waiting on you to accept what it is that they are offering here. I feel like that. And I feel too that if, you know, you guys do not get back together, then I don't think they will get with anyone. Um, for a while I, I just don't feel that um, the four of cups is repeating itself here um, in your spread and theirs um, yeah but I feel like this person is waiting on you to offer to them and only you okay so we have cancer virgo libra aquarius energy here um, scorpio sagittarius energy and um we have Leo, we have, um, did I say Taurus? I don't think so. Taurus energy, Piscean energy here. Mm -hmm. Any other fire sign as well? Leo, um, Aries, Sagittarius energy. Okay, guys, so that's what I have for you, and I will be speaking with you guys soon.